Hello, my name is Justin McCarthy. I'm a lawyer in Massachusetts, and I want to make this video talking about mortgages and the key terms that are in most residential mortgages. Uh, if you buy a home and you get a bank loan in order to, to purchase the house, uh, on the day of the closing you're going to have to go to your attorney's office and you're going to have to sign a whole bunch of bank paperwork. Um, the stack of paperwork could be anywhere from 100 to 150 pages or more. Um, within that stack of paperwork there are two uh, principal documents. Uh, one is the note and the other is the mortgage. Uh, the note is the agreement between you and the lender that the lender is going to give you money and that you're going to pay it back over time with interest. Uh, the note is relatively short it's usually two or three pages long and uh, there's two <clears throat> there's two terms in there that you should be aware of uh, first of all you should make sure that all the numbers are correct the loan amount is right uh, you're comfortable with the monthly payment the interest and so on uh, but the other term that you need to be aware of is that you have a 15-day grace period which means that you have 15 days to to make a payment and if you're late, more than 15 days late, you'll get a 3% penalty on the payment that's owed. Um, also important is if you pay additional each month or any month in particular, make sure that you note on the statement for that month to apply the additional money to the principal of the loan. Otherwise, it'll be applied toward the interest. All right? Along with the note, there's the mortgage. Uh, the mortgage essentially allows the bank to take the house back if you don't make your payments according to the note. Uh, the mortgage is a much longer document. It'll be anywhere from uh, 10 to 20 pages or, or more. And essentially what it says at length is that you're going to pay all bills associated with the property. Uh, so you're going to pay your property taxes, you're going to have homeowners insurance, uh, you're going to pay for the bank's title insurance, you're going to pay assessments, and so on. And if you fail to do that, the bank will pay these things on your behalf and then apply the expense of those things to the principal of the mortgage or of the loan. Uh, probably the most important term of the mortgage is that you have 30 days to make a payment and if you're 30 days past due on a payment, then you're in default, and technically the bank could begin the foreclosure process if it chose to do that. Probably wouldn't, but it, it could. All right, so uh, that's a summation of the two key documents you sign when you get a loan from a bank, the note and the mortgage. Uh, if you have any additional questions, please let me know. Send me a message or send me an email. I'd be happy to answer them for you. Thank you.